Hey everybody, so um, I've talked a lot about, uh, you know, topics with music that basically are going to stimulate your children. Um, so here's sort of what you want to try to do. Um, you want to start off slowly, um, not to like overstimulate them right away. So uh, something that we usually do is maybe sing a hello song. Um, you know, something to that nature so that the kids know, okay, we're starting a music time. Um, the repetition is key. And then move on to something that's more stimulating like I showed you in other vlogs. The last thing you wanna do is you want to start, once you hit that climax, you know, where you, they're getting really stimulated, um, you want to end off sort of like a hill. You wanna go back downhill. So, um, something great to do is to go into slower songs. Now, um, one of the things we do in kinder music is we always sing a particular song um, that is slow where the child is either, if they don't want to lay down, you can lay them down on the floor. Sophia a lot of times does not want to participate and be on the floor. So I'll sit her down and do we do baby massage. So um, say that she wants to be setting up, which she does. Uh, we play the song. The first motion that we do is the heart shape on the chest. So you start here, you go up, and you go down like that. So you're just making a heart shape. It's best when they're on the floor, uh, you're singing this slow song to them. This will slow them down, get them relaxed. Um, then on the second chorus of a song or whenever, you know, they're tired of that part, then you go one arm from the top and you just rub all the way down and you just repeat that motion over and over and over again. Then you go to the other arm. So you're just doing one at a time, one appendage at a time. Then you go to the legs, all the way down to the feet, you know, and then the other one. This will slowly start to calm them down. Um, and you're just getting that little baby massage on. You don't want to put a lot of pressure, just, just barely gently rub and it will get them slowed down. Another thing that we do, that's usually one of the last songs that we do. Um, one of the other songs that we do, um, we actually, I should have put this in the materials one, but we get either a blanket or we get a towel, put it on the floor, put your baby in it or your toddler in it. Um, I lay Sophia in it and then I cross it over. So it's like this. I always make sure she's really secure and then you pick it up and you gently swing them. This totally put Sophia to sleep. Um, usually when we do that song, she's she's spent and she'll start to, you know, blink a lot. And then, you know, uh, and then I will start rocking her, going back and forth, really slow to the next song. And then we do baby massage and she's out. So <laughs> yeah, that's definitely the type of sequence that you want to go. So you want to start off slowly, bring them into that climax where you're stimulating them and bring them back down to the end. She's already getting sleepy. Um, that's what she tends to do. She tends to soothe herself and talk to herself to make herself fall asleep. So yeah. Um, but yeah, that's it. If you have any questions about that, please let me know. I'm, you know, more than happy to answer any questions that you have for me. And, um, and I love using Sophia as my little model. And I think she likes it too. She really likes seeing herself. Oh, see, she's getting sleepy. She really likes to see herself on the screen as well. All right, I will talk to you later. Bye.